it's enormously important to Hollywood. China's gone in the last decade from about the 25th largest market in the world now to number two, just after the United States. In addition to shooting special scenes for China and including some big stars, including Fan Bingbing, one of China's biggest stars in the film, they also devoted a tremendous amount of effort to the marketing of the film and coordinating with the government. They have total control over what gets uh, into China, what's allowed to be distributed there. It's the beginning, I think, of a trend that we're going to see. And yes, they did things in a different way. This is not really a true co-production. They didn't go all the way to make this a, a truly Chinese movie. Uh, but what they did do was include enough elements to make the government happy and get tremendous cooperation. China's modern movie business is really just at its very early stages. They've started building multiplexes, modern cinemas, only in the last few years. They've built uh, very rapidly, so it's now the second biggest number of screens in the world after North America. Uh, and Chinese audiences are embracing movies in ways that uh, a lot of people, frankly, really didn't expect. They love American movies, they love Chinese movies, and it's one of the few entertainment options they have where they can get out of the house and spend a few bucks and go out with a date or go out with the family. So, so movies have uh, really taken off there.